Hey, I've got three timing belt tips that'll help you keep everything synchronized on your next timing belt job. Next. This video is sponsored by Auto Value and Bumper to Bumper. Visit us online for more information. Back when I started working on cars, you could be off a little bit on a timing belt job and it really wouldn't make a difference. With today's modern engines, you need to be on all the time because of crank and camshaft sensors. Any movement back or forth, one or two teeth, you're gonna have a check engine light on that vehicle when it leaves your shop. So here are three tips. First of all, remove the keys from the vehicle and maybe detach the negative battery terminal. Any movement on today's engines can cause misalignment of the timing marks and of the crank and camshaft. If you're not confident about the belt, make sure you count the number of teeth on the belt to make sure that they match the OE belt. Third, after everything is tensioned and adjusted, turn the engine over by hand two or three times to make sure all the marks line up after the engine's moved. Using these three tips can make sure that everything is synchronized and lined up after the job is done. I'm Andrew Markell, thank you very much.